I walked right into this incredible lobby, manufacturing written throughout. I walk up to the front desk. I hand my license to the lady behind the desk. I sign on the dotted line. I sit down next to me. I look up and there's a massive rocket engine. And this rocket engine has been fabricated into the seating in the lobby of the man cave. The door opens, one of the top engineers who I know well walks through. And he says, Titan, thanks for flying up. I walk with him down the corridor. And after taking a tour, we sit down at his desk and he shows me a stack of prints. I look through the prints. And a lot of people would look at those prints and they would be in awe. Not in awe like this is amazing, but in awe like I would never attempt to make these parts. And yet I look at it as an opportunity. I look at the materials. I look at the hardness. I look at the complexity. I look at the tolerances. I take it as a challenge. And he looked right at me and he said, Titan, we're having problems with our vendors. Our lead times are tight, but I know that you can make these parts and I know that you will deliver them on time. I look at him and I said, absolutely no problem. Let me take the prints back to my hotel room. Before I even fly back to my facility, I will have prices for you across the board. I walk out of the facility in awe. You see, I used to be homeless. I used to be in prison. You guys know the stories. And then one day when I had no hope in life, I walked through the doors of a CNC machine shop. I was put in front of a CNC machine and all of a sudden my head clicked. I'd always been good at math. I've always been good at art. And yet I had this aggressiveness that I used as a negative when I had no future, I had no hope, and I had no course. And I had this fearless aggression that was used in a negative when I had no future, I had no hope, I had absolutely nothing. And all of a sudden I come to a place where my head absolutely clicks where my creativity clicks, my aggressiveness clicks, my fearlessness clicks. And all of a sudden, I'm not known for all the things I did in the past. I'm known for making my company money. I'm known for pushing the limits on the machines. You see, CNC machining is unlike any trade in the world. When you look at different trades, you see highly skilled workers. But in CNC machine, you find something so much bigger. There is so much more competition. You have millions of tools and every time you step up to make a part, you have to dissect that tool list. You have to find the right tools with the right parameters. You gotta find the right work holding, the right spindle. You have to put everything together perfectly and every single time you're bidding and competing against the company down the street, the company in the next state, and the company in the country that's working for nothing. You see, CNC machining is the greatest trade in the history of the world. And to every one of you out there in a CNC machine shop, grinding it out all day long, some of you guys are doing production parts, some of you guys are doing prototypes, and some of you guys are just doing a variety of different things. You might be in inspection, you might be in deburring. No matter what it is, if you're in CNC machining, this world cannot move without you. You see, Amazon just doesn't drop off boxes with parts that come out of nothing. These parts are created by you. Without CNC machining, that airplane does not fly, that car does not drive, that rocket will never go into space. And all technology in the world comes to a stop. You don't have computers, you don't have phones, none of it. It all ceases to exist without CNC machinists. And I tell you this, CNC machinists were bred. We were built and created for CNC machining for creating incredible parts. We weren't made to be doctors, bankers, and lawyers. We weren't made to put on a suit and to just talk all day long. We were made to take raw stock to finish part. <clears throat> CNC machining, I love it. And today on Thanksgiving, I just wanna give a huge shout out to all of you guys in the trade. We are the foundation to our country. We are the foundation to every great big company. We are pillars that allow technology to rise. We are pillars that allow the greatest technologies to rise. So be proud of who you are 
and let's be grateful on this Thanksgiving day that we get a B in the greatest trade in the history of the world. Oh, CNC machining, baby. Let's go make some chips. Boom.